Hi everyone, in this video finally we are going to begin the explanation of our car. We could know why were these components were select and the next video we will disconnect the devices of the car. The next one the components are explained one by one and finally the last video we are going to build the cart step by step. Then let's get to see that. In this car we have some devices and in this video I am going to display what are the devices that uh, this car has and what are they important for, for the car. Let's begin. In this part, this car, the principal component of this car is the Arduino. That there is this device right here we have an Arduino this Arduino is the Arduino Mega 2560 this Arduino Mega is sub-used because he has 53, 53 pins and I only use 4, 4 pins this Arduino, this Arduino the brain is the brain of the, of the car the, this Arduino has is the main component because it takes the reading of the encoders, it takes all the measurements and the Arduino tries to take an action to sending signals to the motor to achieve a reference and there is the loop, uh, the feedback loop, loop that we want to obtain um, in a control system uh, for another hand, we have we have the Arduino, and we have right here this this uh, red shield is the bridge edge shield. That bridge edge makes uh, makes possible to uh, handle the motors because the motors needs a lot of power of our battery, and the Arduino can uh, can can handle this, can handle all the power of the power that the motor needs. The, the brain, the brain, it, it, the Arduino is the brain of, of the project, but it has it hasn't the enough power to to make that the motor moves. That's why is is the shield is important. Why it is important the, the shield. On the other hand, the blue uh, down of the Arduino, the, the, the blue element is our battery. In this case, it's a LiPo battery. That LiPo battery is a battery that I used in the in a last in a last project. Uh, I make a, a, a drone and that, that drone I have some videos in Facebook if you wanna to see that. If you could watch in my in my website in Facebook in my fan page and then uh, I will use I will use this battery it's a lipo battery uh, this battery has three cells uh, around 12 volt has uh, it has and the, the other things that the project has is right here a breadboard breadboard that that breadboard right here is, is the connection board that we we use uh, that connection board I, I saw I know that this project is ugly enough but uh, I, I promise that I'm going to improve the the project in the next videos I am going to try to build it, to build this project right and uh, what other uh, elements have uh, I have right here in the front of the of the project right here connect to the breadboard is the 70 78 lm 05 that element 
is a reductor of the of the voltage of the project. Uh, it's made that the battery it's made that the voltage of the battery reduced to uh, 5 volts that is used for the Arduino. I know that the Arduino has a regulator in it, but I break I break some uh, Arduino use this this element then I don't be sure to use it but if you want to use it you could do it you could do it and you could tell me what is the if if there are uh, something wrong in, in it okay uh, for the other hand uh, we have right here the platform the the car <coughs> this plan this platform is very cheap in this case, this platform is not mine, uh, a friend of mine uh, let me this, this platform for this project. Uh, in this case, we have uh, this platform and the platform has two motors and right here the motor has two encoders. These are the encoders that the motor has. Uh, under the encoders, uh, we have some encoders some elements right here down of the breadboard and down from the motors uh, there are there are the measurement there are the dispositive that measures the ticks of the encoders wheels and that's it uh, that those are all the components that the car has it has an Arduino and a bridge edge, it has a battery, it has a breadboard, it has two encoders and right here it has two motor um, two, two uh, encoders and that's it, it's very easy to make it so uh, let's get to it, uh, we are going to disconnect all the components and we want we are going to put uh, together all the elements and I hope that you enjoy this video thank you so much